<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to your favorite part of the show. This is the part of the show where us, the smokers, Bob and Kato. Kato and Bob. Bring you the best advice to ever been given to anybody in the history of advice giving. Ever, ever. Because we are the best advice givers the to bestest. ever give it. To ever give it. You wonder, you probably ask, who the fuck bestowed upon these niggas the title of best advice givers to ever give advice to? And upon the completion of our advice giving marathon in 1996, yep. the Guinness Book of World Records deemed us the best advice givers to ever give advice since the history of advice. And so, they bestowed upon us the task of bringing you more of this good advice. That's for you. Ready or not ready, ladies. So brace ladies. yourself. Be open to receiving and understanding. Okay, then. Be open to being wrong. Because most of the time, people be wrong and they don't want to be open to this shit. And acknowledge if someone else is right. Absolutely. Absolutely. This is Reddit on Reddit. We're going to be right. We're going to be right. And you got to accept it. You gotta Reddit accept it. on Reddit number one. It's number one. I don't see what we got going on. Bro. I don't know. Let's yeah, go to the other one. Because I don't know. We even had it. I don't even know. How to list it. Oh, I okay. want to do the other one, man. Update. Okay. I. A 39-year-old male right. decided to break up with my wife, a 39-year-old female. Okay. And brought it to her to discuss the process. Okay. How are we going to do this, bitch? I'm leaving you. Now she's begging me to stay. Okay. Because she'll change. Okay. I'm desperate to see if people in similar situations made it work. Should I give her another chance? Okay. That's it. That's, that's what we got. That's what we're working with. Um, yeah. Um, no. I don't think so. I don't, no. I don't think so. I think if you've got to the point where you're ready to leave your wife, because you made some vows to your wife to be with your wife for the rest of your life. And you, That's a soapbox of mine. Just the, the vows, I think, is a trigger word now. Okay. I think I put that in my trigger word. You made some promises. <laughs> to your same wife. thing, right? But I won't say the word vows. I just said... <laughs> You you made a commitment to your wife to be with her for the rest still of your is, life. Still, okay. I don't know what else to say. I don't know what else to say. You're a liar. But, 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 you get- <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. Nothing but a liar, a cheater, okay, deceiver, right. heartbreaker. Right. And I won't take you back in my life. So I'm taking I don't the know, house, I can't help. the car, Damn. the kids, Damn. and the dog. Damn. I want it all. Damn. You don't remember that song? No, nah, but that's fucked up. Hey, that's over five oh, too, bro. The niggas had to dance and everything. Well, they was like, everybody, hey. oh, the niggas sang it? Yeah, it's a dude. It's a whole group of dudes. That's <laughs> fucked up, too. <laughs> Shit. That shit was fine. What's up, man? But he took everything. Yeah. He wanted all. dog. But yeah, I feel like <laughs> if this person you promised your whole life to, you feel you strongly enough to where you ready to, like, you got to do some shit to get a divorce for her. Here. You, it ain't just yeah. like, all right, we ain't together no more. Like, yeah, nah, you do have to do shit. stuff. You got to tell yeah, all kinds of shit. I hope y'all ain't got no kids. Like, yeah, it's a whole process. Old, you probably got kids. So if you feel like strong, you strong, you feel strongly enough that this is what you want to do. I don't think, like, if you change your mind, for real, motherfucker might change, and I feel like most of the time, you're going to be back in this situation in six months again, for real. So, I, I, so well, if that's the case, then why not try it and just see if she does change and maybe you get a win out of it, and if not, then you just, where you didn't lose anything. But then you dealt with this shit that you really don't want to deal with, that you already tired of dealing with, you ready to not deal with it now. And now you gonna deal with it for six more months for real. It might be different though, cause she- it, it might be, but it ain't, and I don't think it's genuine anyway. Like uh, this ain't, this ain't- Cause you weren't gonna change yeah, this ain't who, Yeah, this ain't who you want to be, this is, who you trying to be because this is who you think I want you to be for real. That's no, who you said you want me to be. Maybe this, uh, either either way, this ain't who you supposed to be for real. What if it is? I don't think it what is. if I'm about to you, help you, you grow? You trying to be something that you're not <coughs> for real. I go to this chick and I say, look, I'm not working. We need to figure out how we going amic- amic- amicably, yep, we're gonna amicably 
and my mother and my mother. How we gonna split and be all right? Yeah. And uh, she figures out a way to step her game up a couple levels to the point that now we all right without the split. I don't think we we're not gonna we're not gonna get that far. If I come to her and tell her like, yeah, I'm ready to divorce, like we it's, it's over. We I'm fed up, god damn it. And I even if I feel like even if you do and you she wanna change, but like you're not gonna once you don't wanna be here for real, you're not gonna wanna be here again for real. Mm. What if she holds out on you on the divorce? I mean, divorce could get ugly for real. <laughs> it could the divorce could get ugly, shit. <laughs> But I feel like once you don't want to be here, you're not going to be here no more. Nothing's going to change your mind? I, I mean, I guess it could. It could, I guess. But I don't I don't think so. And it seems like maybe you kind of want to be there a little bit if he, if he looking for If he reaching for straws, he grabs He is pulling for straws right now because he's writing the ready like, what should I do? Shit? Nah, like he wants someone else that had the experience to tell him a good experience and a good outcome. Hell. So he could be like, all right, I don't have to do this to her. But, but really, you got to do it. That's advice I got. Yeah. You got to do it. Hey, I, I feel like man, we hear, once you hear, you hear for real. That's what's fucked up. Especially um, if you had the conversation already. In in life, like, yeah. I think that Cause she you, have to, she you have to decide if you're going to, if the time that you spend doing whatever it is you do or don't do is going to be around someone that you feel fits in that or doesn't. And a lot of people spend a lot of time with people they don't feel like fits in with what their time's supposed to be or what they're feeling a vibe or or life is supposed to be. Because it's more convenient to do that. Um for most people. It's more right. convenient to do that. Um but it sounds like it's not more convenient for you, so you should probably just Move on. Yeah, it's that time. Let it be. Like John Lennon. Now. John Lennon said. I don't know. I don't let don't know. it be. I don't let really it fuck be. with the Beatles. Ain't John Lennon let from the be. Beatles? I ain't let heard too be. much from the Beatles that I really fuck with. Whisper words of wisdom. Okay, then. Let it be. Let it be then. I feel like that's what we at for real. You got to let it be. Yeah. And that's the best advice the week is. in the trap. I hope she don't. I hope she don't. What is A I T A H? Am I the asshole? We did this before. It ain't supposed to have an H on there. Okay. Somebody being extra. Um. What we working with? We ready? We ready. Reddit on Reddit number two. Dos. The title is. Am I the asshole for telling my boyfriend the name he wants for our first son is off the table? It depends. It really depends. This one of them situations, it depends. Where the name came from. How does from. it depend? Where the name came from. It don't matter where it, it came it from. It matter where the name came from. Why? Because it matter. How? What you mean? I told you about a situation specifically. I, I know an ex of mine who um, decided to name her daughter with her husband. After me, so this 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 that's not that's strange. That's strange, and I feel like if I'm the husband and I find out my daughter is named after a nigga you used to like, I'm upset about that. You used to like should, or used to you used to date or whatever nigga you used to used live to with. Nigga you used to live with. You got nigga you used to fuck. Oh, okay, bad. You was you fucking too. Yeah, yeah. You was you was having sex with the nigga. Yeah, but yeah, a nigga did. Yeah, a nigga you was in a relationship with. And then you name my kid after that nigga fucking 20 years later. I think that's weird. I think that's weird as fuck. I'm going to have the, a problem with But it's with the that. boyfriend that, that has a name. Now, what was it again? I lost thought because I got personal. Got she, said, she said the boyfriend, she's telling the boyfriend that the name he wants for their son yeah, that's is off right. the table. Yeah, that's what I said. It depends on where the name <laughs> came from for you. Mm. It matters to me where the name came from. If it's your grandmama name or something, fuck that. Yeah, we could go with it. I guess he could have had an ex that was named Sam. And that too. If, if it's Sam. a name that fuck with you, like, yeah, you might not want. Yeah, I don't want to think of this motherfucker every time. 
Krishan just named her baby Krishan. Junior. Junior? Yes. <laughs> Wait a minute. What? <laughs> we did that at the board. Should have been on the board. Junior? <laughs> yes. All right, no, we, we, all right, all right. I don't think that's how they go. But I'm still. saying no, but then, it depends. then all your names that you come up with the kids since you shitting on mine, now fuck your names. But yeah, no, you gotta like I got you. She gotta express her reason for why she don't want this name for real. Yeah, but I want the name. Yeah, but when then if we communicate this shit, then I feel like we should be able to come to fucking yeah, like. This is both our kids. Yeah, this is no name, baby. <laughs> okay. No name, go play with the other kids. This nigga seven, <laughs> God damn it. She got a baby with a seven-year-old. Y'all come to no name birthday party. That's the problem. She got a baby with a seven-year-old, God damn it. I ain't understand, that's what we were saying. No, if I can't name him, he doesn't have a name. Huh. I didn't know we had a baby with a seven-year-old. Look, all I'm saying is if it's fair, it's fair. And if you get to take names off the table, so do I. No, if if it's the reason. I can have my reason. If you've got a legitimate reason that we can discuss, then yeah. Legitimate I no- is all circumstantial. That's yeah, all but this, your This opinion. is somebody you're a partner with. So you got to have some kind of, we can't just, it can't just all be technical, God damn it. All right, well, let's see what they're talking about. Let's see what she's talking about. This is a 24-year-old couple, male and female. Me and my boyfriend had a recent conversation that needs some feedback. All right. Naming our children. Okay. Children. My boyfriend wants to name the first boy we have, Kichi. Oh, it ain't even no, no, no baby yet. I thought it was a baby already, like, the no, bitch is pregnant. They're just oh, planning. shit. Which isn't a bad name, in my opinion. Kichi? It's just... I feel this in this day and age, we deal with a lot of judgment considering we were white. Especially when our son is old enough and in the school. The name is after our favorite mag, uh, manga character. He respects and hopes our um, manga character. He yeah, you know, he respects and hopes our child would grow up to be like. What's the manga character? It's a anime but like just in books but now they're starting to make some of them into actual um, this thing want a child to grow up be like a cartoon <laughs> alright keep going I'm just saying keep going I, that's right. why I was trying to read this. I, I want to read the sentence it's, it's his favorite character he respects Hell, he respect the fucking cartoon right okay I didn't get that I couldn't figure out why this respect I, no, you okay. said, I, 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 I thought I heard it when you were alright yeah, yeah. All right, I thought I like they put the wrong word. No, there. no, yeah, no. He respect the fucking cartoon, okay. and he want his baby. And hopes a child like, will grow. Do up not to have like. a baby with this <laughs> man, lady. <laughs> Fuck the rest of that. <laughs> Fuck what they even talking about. You ain't even got to read no more. Do not have a baby with this man, lady. Do not do it. Do I not. love this, as oh. I am also an avid manga reader, and I think it's cute. But I'm still worried about the possible it's your baby name. Yes, your baby. No, do not do it. Do not do it. I'm naming my next baby Chicken Hawk. <laughs> That's not a character. It is. Which way? The fucking big ass bird. Oh, uh, Lake Foghorn Leghorn. Well, okay, then this is even better. <laughs> That's his name. It's Foghorn Leghorn. Well, whatever that nigga name is. That's even better. That was my uncle' favorite cartoon. My next baby is named Foghorn <laughs> Leghorn. God damn it. When we were little, one of my sisters said she was gonna name up one of her kids Paprika. Okay, I'm, 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 a, I'm, a, um, I'm gonna be honest with you. My name ain't Kato. Okay. Not my my government name's not Kato. Um, okay. It's it's an African name, and it's it's not common, and in the United States, it's not common in the United States. I don't think it's common anywhere for real. Like those, what part of Africa is it from? It's from um, it's from two different parts of Africa. Mm. Um, that's how I know it ain't really common nowhere for real. So you you got like a Sally Mae kind of name? No, nah, no, nah, just not like, with that hyphen. No, nah, like Sally Mae go together. Them two names that go together, like these from but two different countries, so I feel like these words don't even. Okay, I knew someone whose last name was hyphenated, and it was Pedipacura. 
Okay, then. Yeah, nah. That, I, don't I want think to do both that his one. parents were from two different places. I don't want to do that one. I wouldn't. Nah, his just, name was. Never mind. I'm, I, should, I probably shouldn't have said maybe, his last yeah, name. You did, Damn. Yeah, that's why I ain't. I'm trying not to say my name. <laughs> yeah, no, come on. <laughs> but no, nah, we're not going to do that. Yeah, but it's. For, and um, it's very <laughs> unique. I said all that to say it's, it's a unique name. And what did he say? One name, Coochie? So I don't remember. It was Keechy. Keechy. All right. Close then. Um, growing up with a unique, that a new, growing <laughs> up with a unique name <laughs> provides on, girl. a certain. Because your name been a su- substituted with you. You have to be. You got to teach your baby how to fight if you're gonna give him a weird name for real. Because kids is mean and shit, and mm-hmm. they gonna say shit. Oh yeah, my name. Oh, I got so, fucked with. But your name ain't even weird, goddamn. Like your name's common for real. I never knew another one. I, but you've heard that word before. Now, like the older I got, but still, it's my very rare. My name is a word you had not heard. Yeah, that's before. true. That's true. <laughs> that's so. Yeah, that's it might be more fun to make fun of something that was easier to make fun of. So yeah, but like. But I, you didn't even go by that. But I'm no, I mean I didn't. But at school you did though. This is what the teacher called you when she called for like two years. Me. No, not it was a little <laughs> bit more than that. But I'm saying, kids to say shit and like yeah, either you gonna have to learn how to joke, or you gonna have to learn how to fight, or you can learn how to do both. Because no, yeah. I really feel yeah, you really got if you learn how to joke, you gotta learn how to fight anyway for real. Because yeah. if you get to joking with the niggas and you. You supposed to be the nigga they joking on, oh. and you out joke them niggas. Now you got to know how to fight anyway, God damn it. No, I never really got no fights. No? no. Yeah, see, that's how, yeah. No. So, no. um, if you can name no. your, matter of fact, it's a fucking Japanese. What's the name? It's a, I don't, what you mean? <laughs> Let me see. Let me see what the name is again. No, the, the name, that, um, your, your name. Kichi. Your yeah, name they, they look like Kichi. They look like Kichi. No, this one. But I feel like manga characters can probably fight, right? Some of them. So no, maybe, I don't know. maybe it's one that can fight, and you want your kid to be like him anyway. So just teach him how to fight and shit, and he'll be all right with the weird name. But I don't really suggest weird names for real. What makes the name weird? Just not uncommon names, I should say. Then. Well, yeah, I definitely had an uncommon name then. But no, your name's a common name. No, it's not. It is, I mean, it's not like a lot of people, but no, I'm, words from like Kichi. Names that people over here don't know what the fuck they are. People hear your name like, oh, I've heard this name before. No they person, think I say Jordan. I don't know how. But, Nobody correlates the actual name. But I've, I've heard their name before. I've absolutely heard their name before. When you told me your name, yeah, but was, you yeah. heard about hibachery, or, uh, hibachery, or hibachery uh, <laughs> <laughs> from Sanford the Sun. That's all those from Sanford the Sun. That's all the reason. <laughs> but yeah, I'm just saying, uncommon names. You got to they come with things. You got to add thick skin to have an uncommon name. Yeah. For you. Yes. You got to. That's gotta all have I thick skin say. to yeah. live. I um, mean, but it's got to be thicker with a my last name, name too. Okay, yeah, I could see, yeah, like, yeah, was, I might would I thought of something real fast. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> okay, I can see. Yeah, so did everybody else. Yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah, but still, yeah, just, I don't suggest doing it for real, for real. I'm. But I don't see you, what the problem is. If you Fuck do it, shit, just man. know, like, you gonna, you probably go hear about it soon. Name your later. first son Kichi and teach him martial arts. There you so go. So as soon as somebody say something about Kichi and he pulled a fucking the crane from I feel like Mr. Miyagi and them. And, Kichi, and, I, it really does sound like Coochie, but <laughs> okay. it's fine, though. <laughs> What if it's a girl in the come out named Gucci? No, they said the Kichi. first son. They the, want to the name the first son. He wants to name the first son Kichi, and she's really cool with it. She just don't want the son to get made fun of. But the son gonna get made fun. He's of. He's gonna get made fun of. He gonna get made. Teach him how to deal with the shit. That's all you. That's all I advice. Wait, probably wait like two or three more years before you have the kids. Absolutely. And then revisit Absolutely the conversation. Absolutely do that. Don't have the kids. Don't right have now. them. So you twenty not, twenty-four. Not right now. Yeah, give it two or three years. I feel At like least. I feel like if you're ready to name your kids after um comic book characters, wait till you it's start not it. comic books. It's it's a it's a what it's is manga. It? Okay. 
is is on paper. You be trying to get us killed. Like it's, there's gonna be on, one time. On paper. Which I know we don't got like ten thousand views a week, right? It's but it's gonna be one time where a motherfucker who really be into the shit we talking about, and you gonna say the shit you be, you gonna do the it's, shit you be it's doing. It's on paper, and we gonna die. It's on paper. Different types of papers. Yes, they drew some pictures on there. It could have been drawn or printed. It's some pictures on the paper. It's a story that go with the pictures on the paper. It doesn't go with it. It is it. Oh, so and 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 most of the people on the pictures on the paper look kind of cartoonish. No. 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 What did they look? They drawn like real people. Sometimes. They don't look like they drawn. Like it's it's realistic yeah. photogenic. Like it looks like a picture of people. Why are you hating? I'm saying you know it's a fucking comic book. <laughs> you know it is a fucking comic book. It's a comic book from a different fucking culture, I'm so we call saying. it a different it's name. A comic book. Like we from over there. <laughs> that ain't how we do in America. No, it's just when, actually what it's called. When we bring that shit to America, we call it's like it shit. A sub -genre. What the fuck? It's, it's a, not just anime. It's it's manga. It's something different than just anime. So it's not like that's why I'm saying like they really be it's a whole different thing. It's like saying, Oh, you play an instrument, you in a band, but really you're a jazz musician. But they acting it's like three you march. Of you niggas? Are you in a marching band? You in the band, goddamn um, it. You, you a marching band. See, they you, you ain't saying you said you in the band. Well, I, I was thinking marching band. Oh, when okay. Because I, said it. I, feel I the same. Said that. Hey, you gotta add it like this. It's question. three of you niggas, what kind you of boat niggas was in it? the band. What Shit. kind of boat was it, goddamn? But yeah, I don't I don't um if you get mad at me because I call manga a comic book, um it's gonna fuck be you very much. I it don't might give, be the Chinese Kato. I don't give a fuck. I might. hope he's him. <laughs> oh. I hope it's him. Oh man. I hope bitch, I hope if you <laughs> calm down. This I hope you know karate, seven, bitch. Seven three three nine. Because I'm gonna find Ask you. Ask the smokers at gmail.com.